can like just me and my coffee. But I literally already had to microwave it because I like my coffee like screaming hot. So hello, good morning. I look questionable. My allergies are like really starting to get the best of me at this point. Like I was so miserable when I was like getting in bed last night. My eyes were just like watering to the point where it literally looked like I was crying. And my eyes were so itchy. My nose will not stop running. My nose is so like chafed and sore from constantly blowing it and wiping it. And oh, it's disgusting. So I actually just ordered from Target some handkerchiefs because I'm just so sick of like using towels and like napkins and really rough tissues. And eventually they all just get like so gross and like crumbled up and ripping. And so I'm like, I need something like reusable because I also hate that I'm just like using so much paper. I don't know. I feel like it's not good you know, for the environment and whatnot. So, I heard handkerchiefs. I was having a clock this morning and that's pretty much as exciting as my day has been so far. This is the new book. I don't think I showed this yesterday, but this is the new book that I picked out to read. I don't really like to read like the summary of books, so I don't know what it's about, but it's a book of the month club. So I feel like those books are usually really good. So I'm excited. He was just waiting for me to get up so he could literally just cop my whole seat. Wow, you look so cozy, Sankey. Are you super comfy? He's like, don't bottle me. So he's Sankey, I won't bottle you anymore. You enjoy your nap, even though you just woke up. Having some egg whites and sweet potatoes for breakfast. Ooh, it's hot. Watching 30 minute meals. Life is good. I just finished a workout. And I actually didn't film any of it like on my camera because I was filming it for like Instagram. But I thought I would just show you some of the clips from Instagram so you can see what I did. I really, really like using sliders for like leg workouts. Honestly, you can use it for like every body workout, but they are really good for leg workouts. So I loved this workout. I'm gonna show you like a couple clips from it. So this was today's workout from Sydney Cummings. I freaking love her. See how like ugh, you just have to drag your foot instead of lifting it. It makes it so much more difficult. Almost there, eight. And then these were so good, like just for the booty. My hair was a hot mess. Right in this front glute. These felt so good. These are probably my favorite. I put it right there, but these are like my favorite slider move. These were like plank jacks, but instead of jacking, you like just slide your legs. They are like inner thigh. They're abs. They're everything they feel so good but they're actually pretty hard and this was just kind of like a squat and then you like drag your leg in so it was definitely like an inner thigh kind of thing but also you know a little bit of booty too and then i had to mute this because i was like panting into the freaking phone but these are body saws oh they hurt everything and then these are like, I don't even know. I've never even seen these before. I thought they looked so easy and then I tried them and they're very, very difficult. Apparently they're like advanced and they take like your whole, your back, your abs, your arms, your thighs, like literally works out every muscle. I loved that one. And then this one was also really hard, but I really, really liked it. It was like a lot of um, hamstrings and a lot of calves, but it felt good even though it was hard. And then this is just kind of the burnout at the end. Let's go backwards right here. Just in a squat and then just like moving your leg kind of all around. That was today's workout. I actually already edited and uploaded a video for today. So I feel like I've been fairly productive. It's only like not even 11.30 yet. Oh. The, it's supposed to be nice out today, but I'm like still waiting for the sun and the warmth. But it's supposed to be like high 70s and then into the 80s a little bit later on today. So I'm like really ready for it. I was just, it's still like kind of overcast. So I'm curious. More big things. I just had Ken hang this guy. We had to use um, nails. Like the sticky stuff that was on it was definitely not strong enough. So it's like totally out of the way. Not an eyesore. You honestly can't even like see it when you open the cabinet. You literally have to be in there to notice it. But it's so much more convenient now. It's feeling so beautiful out here. You can wear flip-flops for sure. It's like nice and warm and sunny. Ken's weed whacking. Thank goodness. 
This grass looks so bad, holy shit. I've had on my to-do list for a couple days to like get the dead mom out of here and the dead plant that was in there. So I dumped the dead plants, which is very good. This um, is for a donation. I think it's like a veteran organization. They like drop these bags off and then you leave them on your porch and they come and get them. You just fill them with donations. But I ripped... <gasps> Willie, what are you doing? <laughs> Stay inside. Um, but I ripped that one, so I hope that doesn't break. And then I just went around and like picked some weeds. But honestly, if I were to pick all the weeds I need picking, I'd be... It would probably be like a month long project of doing it like every single day. There's so many freaking weeds. So I'm hoping the treatments and stuff we're doing are gonna help, but it made me feel better to get at least some of the weeds out. It's like so ugly. Also, Ken put his new. How do you like the new floor mats? Do they fit? Do we need to trim them? No, I think perfect. Is your car still unlocked? I wanna see. I'm excited to see them actually. Let me put my shoes on. I had the door open just now. I was like vlogging and Willie just walked out. Oh, really? Just walked out. Big dum dum. <gasps> wow, those actually fit perfectly. Wow, they're almost like they're not small, but they're. Wow, these are perfect. They're from the brand Armor All, by the way, that car brand. Wow, that looks awesome. That looks awesome. The second I open the window, Willie just sits here and waits for me to like pull this back, <laughs> and then he jumps up into it. You like sitting by the open window, Sankey? What do you see up there? He is a poked up. Oh, Nago. Do you want to see out the window too? <gasps> what is it? What is it, Sankey? You guys like with the window open? Oh, I don't think there's room for both of you on the window sill, though, Nala girl. <laughs> Turns out we haven't been doing a very thorough job vacuuming. Notice I said we, I didn't blame you. Collective thing, you know, because of our team and everything. I was just like rubbing the carpet back here. Cause it was like, he set up the Alexa. And look at all this freaking cat hair that I just pulled out of the freaking carpet. That is so gross. What do you have to say for yourself? I'm having some leftover Jersey Mike's. And a little salad. Thank you, Bobby. Oh. Oh my gosh, ow. I love foam rolling. Foam rolling, I highly recommend. Ken got me one for Christmas. I never was really into it, but when you're sore, it does feel really good. Okay, now it's time to tackle this like massive pile of summer clothes. I need to see what fits, what doesn't, what I want to keep, what I want to get rid of. So this has been sitting here for like two days. I need to ooh, just do it. So I just like totally got a real caught up in that and I didn't even pick up the camera to like document any of the process. I was doing that for probably like two, an hour and a half, two hours for a while, but that whole entire pile is cleared up i was having another cup of coffee because i drink decaf also i don't know if i've ever mentioned that i drink decaf coffee i don't even drink caffeine ever but i just really like coffee so i had ken make me another cup i cleared up that whole situation a couple of things that i'm just getting rid of are over there and the closet is pretty much situated i have these sticking out because i forgot that i have scarves in here so i need to like pack those away there's no reason to keep those out but I took stuff out of here. It looks a little weird having only three open. But once I take the scarves out of here, I might kind of rearrange this stuff. But I have some of my shorts here. Ken's shorts there. I put all his clothes away, which were like some of the tank tops and some of the t-shirts. And then I packed up some um, like sweaters and like other winter stuff and put that stuff up there. I put out all my like dresses and kind of just like rearranged this. All the shoes have already been done. But basically like an hour and a half, two hours ago, there was like stuff everywhere on the floor here and everywhere on the floor out here. And well, I need to pack for my in-laws this weekend, so that's why that's here. But otherwise, it's all clear out here. So we have made a very good progress. I have the windows open in here because it's so freaking nice. Just like the smell of the fresh air is so nice, even though it's probably not any good for my allergies, but it feels good. 
So finally, like that whole switching over the clothes thing was on, has been on my list for so long and it's just in the nick of time because I think like the warm weather is officially here pretty much to stay. It looks like it's going to be like the high 70s and 80s for the foreseeable future. So I think my timing is very good and it's just like such an involved process like between bringing this stuff out of the garage taking the winter stuff out packing it away taking the summer stuff out putting it away sorting it organizing it. i actually got rid of a ton of stuff because a lot of it doesn't fit me anymore because i've lost a lot of weight since i bought all of it last summer so not even a year ago which is kind of a shame but that's okay so getting rid of stuff hanging stuff up reorganizing like it's just such a process so i'm so glad for it to be over with that took like a cumulative like week i swear Ooh, but now it's done, so I don't have to think about it anymore until, you know, six months from now we have to do it again. But I'm so relieved to have that done. <sighs> I can finally cross off switching out the clothes. Thank goodness. Uh, thank you. A kid. Kid. Oh, she needs okay. to scan it again. Thank God. Oh, God. We're getting more birthday food for free right now. Thank you, YouTube. Thank you. Uh, this is, it's literally dangling. <laughs> it's not babe, it's gonna fall. Just Why did she not Push pack it, it in with your mouth. I did already. <laughs> Why did she do that? Is it her first day? Yeah, it might be, so don't miss her room. <laughs> it's her first day of work during Corona. But hasn't she ever had ice cream in her life? Yeah, you don't even need to be have any training to know. Dangle it on there so it can fucking gingerly. <laughs> Alright, we got our free Baskin Robbins in a cake cone. Ken always gets the Snickers. I don't like it. Here you go. Yeah, thank you. And then we're gonna go to TCBY to get Froyo for me. Next stop, TCBY, my fave. It's not your fave. Well, I like, I like frozen yogurt is what I mean. Okay, thank you. Theirs is not that good. I think it's fine. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Stay healthy. Far back in the corner behind the thing, prop <laughs> it up so that it's not possible to get it out without everything falling out. Yeah, that's I put, a, I put a lot of thought into that. Yeah, that's why it takes you two hours. Uh-huh. Because you're like, wait, no, 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 hold on. I can't this even more. <laughs> just, I gotta restart. I gotta restart. I can extract more tears of pain from him in this way. <laughs> oh, TCBIY. Hmm? A TCBY was a fail because that location wasn't open, which makes no sense because I checked and it said it was. So anyway, we'll have to go to a different location, a different time. I'm gonna make all these companies honor these get coupons. Well, I shouldn't say make, but I'm gonna hope that once, even if these coupons expire, that they will still honor them if they were closed, you know? Uh, I can't believe it. You know? Yeah. You don't care what I'm saying? I do not care. Babe, no. This is the pressure. The other day I was doing it, he actually started liking it. And then he stopped, like, freaking out. And, like, biting. Wow, good job, Sanka boy. I mean, you do enough, you do it to him enough, he just gets used to it. You but don't. No, this was the way that it worked last time. <laughs> Look at him holding on as if he's about to fall. <laughs> good job, Will. Look at you. Proud of you, Zanky. But what are you investigating, Nalgo? What do you see out there? Oh, are you scared? Okay. Is it good? We're over here kind of ratchet, <laughs> having some of our Burger King leftovers. Amazing birthday weekend continues. Oh yeah. It's gonna, you are really having a birthday, like more than a birthday weekend, honestly. As I should. Uh -huh. I deserve it. Getting all up in there. No more hidden cat hair that I have to scrounge up. No, like get like behind behind the table. Okay. All right, just got another video edited and upload. This is kind of a long. Well, all my videos I end up being like over 20 minutes. I feel like I like cannot ever shut up. <laughs> I talk too much. But that's about to be it for the night. I think we're going to. Oh, I need to turn this pot around. It's bugging me. The little things uh we're going to watch band of brothers of course because we cannot stop till we finish it but the next couple days should be really fun of vlogs we're going to my in-laws tomorrow to celebrate ken's birthday and then 
tomorrow's Saturday. And then Sunday is his actual birthday, but it's also my niece's birthday, so we're doing like a whole family little get together party like technically we're not supposed to be going there because our county um has like a shelter in place order so technically we're not supposed to be going anywhere but once we're out of the county it's fine and i mean we're just going to see family we're not really like doing anything that i feel like is like crazy breaking the rules so actually that's an update that i should mention the governor of the entire state not just the county but the entire state is now in a shelter in place order because before it was literally just well maybe it was a couple other counties but it was just our county that had a shelter in place order but the governor just issued the, the entire state has a shelter in place order starting on monday and so today's friday so in a couple days and that is for 30 days so basically the entire month of april is stay in place where you can't have any large gatherings can't do anything besides like the bare minimum of groceries and going to the doctor and getting takeout that's pretty much it so i don't even know babe if we're gonna be able to go to easter i mean i'm sure we can probably travel to see family but you're really technically not supposed to but easter falls in that time period it's just crazy that for a whole entire month people are just not supposed to like see their friends see their family like i was really not sure if i was expecting them to like lock the entire state down especially for a whole month like that's just a long time to i don't know but if they gotta do what they gotta do so anyway we're gonna cuddle up Watch some Man of Brothers, and we will see y'all tomorrow for day. Today say like twelve, right? I don't even know now. Day Friday thirteen, fourteen. No, Monday will be fourteen. I don't know. Day like thirteen or something. <laughs>